Hey, welcome back everybody. It's KB here and today I'm gonna show you the new BlueStack 4 Android emulator. So if you have used a BlueStack before, so you know what's going on here. But if you are a new to the BlueStack or any Android emulators, so BlueStack is a software which lets you run the Android apps and games on your Windows PC. So now for those people who have used a BlueStack, you know how BlueStack used to look and how the BlueStack is now evolving and getting better. So this was some old BlueStack and this was, do you remember any of these? Okay, this was sometime the BlueStack used to look like this and this was the last version which was BlueStack 3 and looks quite simple the older ones are like all messy uh, everywhere like ads apps and everything so but bluestack 3 was pretty good but recently they released a bluestack 4 which is way better than any old bluestack so yeah let's go to the official site of bluestack so i will put link in the description you can go there and visit the official site of bluestack and download the BlueStack 4 and we can see here this is the home page of the official site and it says the BlueStack 4 and uh, six times faster than the Samsung S9 plus they are claiming it so we'll talk about that later so it says simpler faster more powerful I mean I'm really impressed I used it to play PUBG and have done other things and it is really amazing this is the best update that we have got for BlueStack so you can download this from here we have the download button we just click on it and install it now let's just run the BlueStack okay and we'll see the new boot logos and everything so as you can see here it's booting up and it should boot quickly because it's a new blue stack and it is faster than any old blue stacks so as you can see here gonna take like 30 seconds 40 seconds so yeah I have pretty good PC as you can see here it loaded up within the 20 to 30 seconds and this is the new blue stack if you have used any old blue stacks you know you know this is really big change clean interface no you know the useless tabs for the applications and other stuff the things the features of old blue stacks are here but now they are in compressed version like we have to click on these applications like we still have the app center but it's now in like separate application which is really clean you know which makes the blue stack clean because you know in old version it used to be on the tab you know uh, that was annoying and we have the google play so first thing that i really like the dock idea you can see here we got the dock here we got some important applications app center google play level up instance manager uh, where we can create the multiple blue stacks and yeah that's pretty much it this is like the the best update ever for blue stack and uh, you can see by yourself if you have ever used a old blue stack you know this is really the best update for blue stack and we have the search bar within the search bar we got some ads but it's not distracting in the home page when we go out in the home page see everything is looking clean so really nice we can search for game like pub g okay i'm just gonna search for it i have already installed it anyway so uh, you can see here we can install it from the app center or we can also visit the google play really nice and the performance is also really nice so as you can see here it's the google play store and uh, you can also play the pub g and uh, let me show you what are the new things I mean they have changed you know the whole entire interface they have made it simpler now faster simple means faster the blue stack is running on android 7 and uh, they have added the new you know key mapping tool i mean they have redesigned it and now it looks clean simple uh, similar to blue stack 3 but you may feel little 
difference between the old one and the new one so you can see here we have the key mapping tool which is pretty clean and nice and uh, yeah we have the toggle key for the key mapping appearance we can just turn it down or you know the most important thing is that they have made the blue stack simpler and faster so now let's talk about as they claim that the blue stack is six times faster than the samsung galaxy s9 so about that thing my comment my opinion will be that if you have an old pc and really poor pc you don't have enough ram and processors then it won't be fast as s9 plus but if you have a good pc you can add more ram processors to the blue stack that means it could be faster than samsung galaxy s9 plus so you know let's just go into the settings of this blue stack here we can do all the settings related to our android blue stack so we can set the resolution dpi so lower resolution means it will run faster if you have a poor pc but if you have a really good gaming type of computer then you can bump it up to like 1080p so it depends on you so that's why they claimed it like it is fast but you also need a good pc to be fast you know to run the blue stack fast so we can go into the engine we can select the direct x or open gl it depends on you but the most important thing is the cpu cores and the memory so you can see here i'm running on default two cpu cores but i can select up to like eight you know four will be enough so if you have a good amount of you know good processor that means you can select the four and it will make the blue stack run faster and if you play pubg or any type of heavy game then it will run fast and smooth now another most important thing is the ram you can add up to four gigabyte ram which is maximum ram you can add in blue stack so if you have a eight gigabyte of ram uh, in your pc then you can give the blue stack four gigabyte ram you can just increase this slider and you can make your blue stack run faster so that's how you know it could be fast as like samsung galaxy s9 plus so if you have a you know the old pc or low powered pc then do not expect to run the blue stack as fast as they claim six times faster than the samsung s9 plus so yeah that's how you do the settings in the blue stack and make your blue stack faster so it's not a new thing but you know i need to explain you because they claim it it is fast so you know you need to know that what's going on and how to fix the problems if you like install the blue stack and you are you're like oh no it is lagging the blue stack it's not fast as they claim but if you have a good pc you can change it so yeah and uh, yeah what else to say you know I, all i want to say is that if you have ever used a blue stack you know what's going on here the blue stacks best update ever we got the new dock we got the simple design simple design means much faster performance in the blue stack that's all i have to say about the new blue stack 4 and uh, as you know there are many android emulators and now the blue stack is taking over them finally blue stack is like one of the best top android emulators you know a few days ago i made a video on like top android emulators and on that time i had a blue stack 3 because blue stack 4 wasn't released and right after that you know i was just watching some random youtube video and i got the ad of the blue stack 4 that's how i knew that the blue stack 4 is out and i had to do something because recently i made a video about the blue stack and other emulators and you know the blue stack is actually winning the race of best standard emulators you know so yep that's it that's my opinion about the blue stack and uh, yeah i will put link in the description for the blue stacks official site you can go there and download the blue stack 4 and have fun with the new blue stack 4 emulator that's it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye